Hi, we are KMC Robo Physicists, a team of undergraduate students from Kirodi Mal College, University of Delhi. This video gives an insight into the technical aspects of the rover KMC MR04. The rover is being made to participate in the Mars Society's University Rover Challenge to be held at the Mars Desert Research Station, Utaha, USA, from 28 to 30 May 2015. The challenge is to design and build the next generation Mars rovers. KMC MR04 features a dynamic rocker bogey suspension system with four wheel steering and six wheel drive. The rover has a 100 cm wheel base, 45.5 cm height and 70 cm width. The height of rover including the height of camera is about 127 cm. The forward and backward motion is facilitated by four DC motors connected to the front and rear tires. Distributing the weight and drive torque to six wheels instead of four gives the rover greater traction and stability. The rover has aluminum tires with rubber coating connected to an omni drive system. Above the front and rear tires there is one rectangular plate each. below which a servo motor is clamped which is connected to a worm gear at right angle to a spur gear to enable a 360 degree turn the front and rear wheels turn inwards by equal angles then on commanding the left side motors to turn clockwise and the right side motors to turn anti clockwise the rover can take a 360 degree turn at its position Although we intend to rotate the rover by 360 degree using omni drive but we also have differential drive to enable turning of the rover Dynamic rocker bogey of the rover incorporates rockers connected to the differential bar When the rover crosses over an obstacle differential bar turns and pushes the rest of the wheels against the ground The robotic arm of KMC MR04 has 6 degrees of freedom. It is designed in 3 different configurations, each designed for different competition tasks. A camera is mounted on the arm for the video feedback. The limb of the arm includes the shoulder and elbow joints and the attachment point for the end effectors at the wrist, which is the differential gear. The limb's shoulder and elbow joints are each actuated by a linear actuator. Both the shoulder and the elbow are capable of 0 to 120 degree range of motion. The maximum load that the arm can lift is about 10 kg. The arm rests on a rotatory platform mounted on the chassis. The rotatory platform helps us to cover areas beyond the line of contact of the arm without having to turn the rover. The differential gear provides a complete wrist movement to the arm. It helps in the vertical up down motion of effectors and also in rotation of the effectors. A gear on the front of differential gear provides a point of attachment for the interchangeable effectors. Effectors have a gear ratio of 6 is to 1 and load capacity of 7 kg. The enhanced four interlocking fingers of the effector facilitate easy picking of hammers and cans. and make tasks like turning the walls much easier for the purpose of digging we have designed a scoop with a lid which is made up of mild steel the movement of the scoop is controlled by a servo motor which is connected to the scoop through a u shape attachment along with developing this rover kmc robo physicists has also worked with the community in public outreach programs to promote further interest in the project The team participated twice each at Asia's foremost security conference, the Ground Zero Summit, and also at the Grand Cultural Festival of the University of Delhi, Antardhwani. Thank you, and Namaste.